We're here in Sea Pines at 17 Club Course Drive, and this is a, it's a lovely little cottage-like home uh, near the front gate and near the um, Sea Pines Country Club on a nice size lot with a detached two-car garage. Nice big lot. And on the other side, uh, it sits right next to Isle of Pines Drive. I don't know if you can see that. So there's nobody directly beside you either, which is kind of nice. Nice driveway. I'll turn around and show that to you. And then brick pavers, or brick walkway up to the front door and over to the detached garage, which you can come out of the garage I don't have a key to it, but um, you can come out of the garage and go directly into the laundry room. This gives you a look at the side yard as well. But it sits back nicely off of the street. Lots of parking here. It's, of course, in, a, in the club course section, which I wouldn't recommend this for a rental home, um, for a short-term rental home, but certainly for a second home or primary home, um, it, it has some nice features. And so as you walk through the front door, nice sense of arrival in a foyer, entrance that's open to the uh, family room, living room space. Off to the right, there's the front bedroom, which is a nice size. There's a king bed in here presently. Newer carpet. And lots of light. Tile floors in the in the entry and into this little hallway and then into the bathroom here. Nicely up, updated. We'll go this way first. The second bath is also nicely updated. This shower is not super updated, but it's, it's, it's nicely maintained. And the vanity with the mirror over top is very nice. Smooth ceilings throughout. Same carpet in here. This is the other front bedroom. With some nice wood detail on the walls. And this also has a king size bed in it. Closet is over here. In the owner's suite, they have a L uh, laminate floor, an LVP floor. there's ample room in, in here with a view out the a private view out the back. The ceilings are uh, eight foot ceilings, so you do feel that a bit, especially in in this uh, bedroom. Walk-in closet here, as well as another walk-in closet over here in the bathroom. And then nice linen closet as well. So a good amount of storage space. A huge soaking tub and deep. Walk-in shower. And a dual vanity. Nice, a nice long one too. With the recessed lights overhead. see the rest of the house. You do have attic access here in the hallway coming out of the bedroom. And then coming back to the foyer we come into the main living space with a bevel tray ceiling, hardwood floors, little bar area that goes right into the kitchen. 
I'd probably paint these cabinets. They're an oak cabinet with a raised panel. I'd probably paint those, get a nice, really nice um, cabinet paint and paint these cabinets. Have a little wine fridge in here. And then a cooktop looking out to your family room and dining. A good amount of storage space. Doesn't look like a real big kitchen, but with the cabinets on the back side here, you have a good amount of storage, and then you also have some storage in here where they have an extra refrigerator and actually a freezer here too. That pro these probably go with them, but um, and then this is goes right out to the garage. Nice walk-in pantry in here as well. So that certainly helps with, could use a little WD-40 on those hinges, but other than that, um, it, it's, it's very nice. And then this, I'm sure, was a screen porch at one point in time that they have converted into living space, and it, it's a really lovely room. Lots of nice sunlight coming in here. I'll show you a little bit more of it when we come back in. Whoop. Well, we'll go out a different door. So you come out off to the side. They had there's a, a little side porch. This is very cute with the table set up here. Your grill. And then all of this space next to a, a lagoon. And then this wraps around to the back where you have a lot of extra, a lot of space back here. That's the door that I couldn't get out. It's just locked. It's, there's nothing wrong with it. it. I'm just, it's user error. Um, I might put gutters across the back here if needed. Um, and depending on how deep this lot goes, you could certainly even put a pool in right here and then you have a, a, a view out to a golf hole, uh, the, out to the green beyond these trees. It, it, it's a stretch, it's not right right up on the golf course by any means, but um, you do have, have a nice nice view and real, really very, very private back here. So I just want to give you another look at this room. Probably, if you were going to put a TV in this room, prob you'd probably have to put it in a corner, which would kind of be a shame with all these nice um, windows. Or you could put it on an arm over here, um, or maybe a over in this corner. But the, the setup in here is, is very nice with uh, a little bit of office space, place to, to read a book and just chat while still being connected, as you can see, to the to the main family room and living room space. So I hope this helps. Um, it, it, it's a nice home. Three bedrooms, three full baths, two car garage priced at 925 in Sea Pines. I'll talk to you soon.